We're here with Captain Julian Gluck, our Airman of the Year for this year. So tell me a little about yourself and why you think you got nominated for this. Absolutely. I'm Captain Julian Gluck. I go by Cosmo. I'm a B-52 aircraft commander with the 20th Bomb Squadron Buccaneers mm -hmm. down at uh, Barksdale Air Force Base in Shreveport, Louisiana. And I was nominated for this. I found out when my dad saw an AFN commercial, told my little brother about it, and they put in a package for me. And while I was deployed to Guam for the continuous bomber presence, I had heard about this, and it's just been a whirlwind coming in for it now. What was your reaction when you found out? Uh, I was very surprised. I think there are thousands of people in the Air Force that are deserving of recognition for the contributions they do as service members or in their communities. But I'm very grateful for the opportunity to represent my squadron, the bomber community, and the community organizations I'm proud to work with. What's it feel like to be in the entire 300,000 plus member Air Force? You're the person sitting in front of me today. Uh, it, it's, it's a little overwhelming, um, but uh, I'm glad to have gotten to meet so many people through this, the other service members of the year, and uh, the opportunity to meet people in, in Washington, D.C. that run so much of the Air Force and just pick their brain and, and see what I can take back to my unit and as far as uh, how I can help in the mission. Walk me through some of the things you do to kind of, that got you here. Sure. Most recently, I've, I've gone on my second deployment. Uh, my first one back in 2017 was Operation Herent Resolve and Freedom Sentinel mm -hmm. uh, with the 96th Expeditionary Bomb Squadron and we did actions for the liberation of Mosul and Oraka. Uh, the most recent deployment was to Anderson Air Force Base in Guam, so the deterrence and assurance mission in the Indo-PACOM region. Mm -hmm. And as far as community involvement, I'm involved with the Civil Air Patrol as the Deputy Commander for Cadets for Barcelona Capaz Squadron. Mm -hmm. We work with middle school and high school aged kids for aerospace education, emergency services, and cadet programs finding different ways that they can become involved as citizens and as potential members in the, the military, but mostly just to inspire them. And then additionally, I'm involved at the local, state, and international level with the Knights of Columbus, which is a, a fraternal organization. So being a bomber pilot isn't exactly a quiet job. How do you find time to do all that? Oh, it, it's definitely not quiet if anyone's been around a B-52. Mm -hmm. uh, the biggest thing is the, the mission always comes first, so you have to go in, get your reps into the squadron, doing your training, flying sorties, and then when there's time available after that, that's when I like to get involved with finding out what opportunities are there in my area or if I'm traveling to try to make a difference in the community. Great, and finally, what, what's the message you try and push down to these, key, these people that you're mentoring? Well, the biggest thing I wanna impart to young people in the United States is that there are volunteer opportunities everywhere. And it only takes a moment to, to look it up, go on the internet, find something that you're passionate about, mm -hmm. and then go out there and do it. And, and uh, for you, what do you think it's going to feel like later this week to walk across that stage and get handed the Airman of the Year Award? I'm not exactly sure what it's going to feel like, but I'll, I'll definitely get back to you. I <laughs> think it's, it's definitely going to feel like a, a wonderful moment of, that I, I never would have anticipated. Awesome. Thank you, sir. We appreciate it. Thank you very much.